So today I'm going to be showing you guys how I make fluffy pancakes in a vlog. In a vlog I'm going to be posting next week. You're going to hear my discussion about how I learned how to make pancakes. And I'll just summarize it for you. I used to work back of the house, front of the house, serving food when I was in the UK. So I did that um, for some time before I started working my normal jobs. But I used to do that as a part-time job and I loved it so much. And when I was there, I learned a lot of recipes. But some of them I have forgotten. But the ones I remember, I want to share with you. And the first one is these fluffy pancakes. So these are not Nigerian pancakes. This is full food pancake, basically. I hope you like it. They're very delicious. And I hope you click like on this video, subscribe, and don't forget to share. So if you're interested in seeing how I make it, let's start cooking. So the first thing I'm going to do is to sieve my flour. I'm using normal flour, all-purpose flour. And I'm also going to be sieving my baking powder. This is necessary so that if there are any lumps or clumps or anything, you will find it. For example, now this is baking powder. See all the lumps in there. So I'm going to be adding the baking powder. I'm then going to be adding sugar. Next, I'm going to just combine the dry ingredients together and set aside. In another bowl, I'm going to beat up some eggs, just not too heavily. I'm going to add vanilla essence. I'm transferring them to a bigger bowl because I realized my bowl was too small. <laughs> so now after transferring them, I'm adding milk. I'm using a lot of milk because I'm making a lot of pancakes for my family. Next, I'm going to add melted butter. I put it in the microwave and I allowed it to stay till room temperature so it's cold right now. I'm going to mix all the wet ingredients together. I forgot to add that you're going to put a pinch of salt also. Now I'm going to be adding the wet ingredients to the dry ingredients just little by little gradually until everything is properly combined. If you have lumps, don't worry, just mix it for about two to three minutes till it's till it's well combined. So you're just going to mix, 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 mix. Allow it to just stay for a minute or two so that it will relax. You see, I still have lumps, but when I start making it, the lumps will disappear. Next, heat up a pan and I'm just adding a bit of butter to it. So you just heat up this pan and spread it all around. You can use vegetable oil and then you're going to scoop your butter into it gradually. You can make it as small or as large as you like. I don't like it to be as large as the pan, just like a, a circle. You see, when it starts bubbling on top like that with holes, that's when you know you're ready to flip it. Do not press this pancake is meant to be light and fluffy so you're just going to allow it fry for about a minute or two till the underneath gets brown like this and your pancake is ready i'm just going to do another batch because like i said i'm making a lot for my family today anyways this is what it looks like made look at the heap of pancakes it was so good everybody had a nice time and we had it with some syrup if you like this recipe don't forget to click the like button don't forget to subscribe i'll see you guys in my next video bye